on. This is Blind Knights. Let's see how this game goes, bro. I heard good things about it, especially from a couple of buddies of mine. Shut my door. Make sure I have my water ready. Now, I played the first one. I'm not gonna... I'm gonna admit it, but I didn't finish it. But we'll see how this game goes. If I like it a lot, and I at least, you know, get some views on it, comments on how I could better improve oh, my, my, my... the gaming experience for not just only me, but you guys as well. I'll continue it. Let's see. What is this? Custom creation. Like, I know I have to buy... I need to buy a video camera for the PlayStation. That's what I'm running on. It's a PlayStation 5. And then I know I gotta buy a new mic and a new controller. I need to buy a new everything, to be honest. Go with that. Not really much you could do, huh? Is it there? It's like... Oh, that's the hair they already have. Go bald. I have a big beard, so... I'll go with that. It looks trimmed enough. Black hair. I'm not bald in real life, but I do have a beard. If I had to choose a hairstyle that looks like mine at the moment, it would probably be this one right here. You know what? Yeah, we'll go with that. Scars. I don't... don't have scars. That scar does look pretty cool, though. The one that's going with, across the eye. There we go. That one goes hard. Hardcore character skip tutorial. Yeah, I've played only the tu tutorial. That's the only thing I've played in this game so far. All right, I think that's good. But I ended up deleting the character because uh, I chose the wrong class archetype. My bad. Um, let's see. Confirm. Uh huh. We'll skip tutorial. Ugh. God, I don't know what all this is, but I do not want to find out. Not bad. Not bad at all. Why does he close his eyes like that? What? Hold on. I could use that. I don't know what all this is, but I don't want to find out. Well, I don't know what all this is, but I. I don't want to find out. I could use that. I don't know what all this is, but I do not want to find out. Uh, I don't like the looks of this. I don't like the looks of this. Not bad. I could use that. Yeah, we'll go with that one. All right. We're going to go with veteran. Oh, wait, hold on. Alright, here. Yeah, I accidentally chose this one instead of this one. I wanted to be a medic. So we will go with the medic. Do you wish to create your character with these settings? Yes, I do. Alright, what am I? Okay, yeah, this is where I left off. To be honest, yeah, this is exactly where I left off. Okay, hold on. So I have the gear because I did buy the digital, yeah, the digital deluxe or whatever edition because it was on sale. Let's 
go with this one. Let's see what this outfit looks like. That looks pretty badass, not gonna lie. Okay, we'll go with that. I wish I could change my backpack. Backpack doesn't look like it goes with it. Uh, hold on real quick, let's see. I swear to God and my mother. Did Bo send you over here or did you stumble your way over here yourself? Well, if there isn't a first time for everything. My work happened. Questions, I guess I'll leave. Uh, let me save you then. A stranger now. What you got? Okay, let's see. What would be a good one? Let's see, um, I say hot shot would be pretty good. Hot shot or concussive shot weapon mod fire fires a focused blast of air through all targets within eight meters dealing 50, 155 damage and four times impact you have to be within that many meters though we'll go with this one you don't have to be that okay. close no just in case me thinking I might not ever see you again they said you ran off with that old Ford fella and disappeared I ain't seen you since where have you been you mean that big-ass floating gym over there both said it can take you other places other worlds even before we got here I'd have laughed in his face but I've heard weirder stories than that really see on your face it ain't all make-believe is it feels like anything can be true here they even yeah I don't know what's in that stuff Doc Nora gave me but I ain't felt this good for years hell maybe it was Fulton's blend <laughs> ah you know me I get anxious sitting still for too long so I went out to the ruins and scrounged anything useful I could find I was just doing what I do to survive you know maybe get some things together for when we moved on but then you didn't come back and Bo said folks around here could use this stuff so I set up shop so hey if you ever need anything out there in the worlds or whatever you just let me know I got all kinds of stuff for trade okay Let's see what you got Seller stuff too, huh? Okay. Your debt's still at two now. Remember that. All right then. Uh, what can I do for you? How much is to upgrade? Cost that much scrap, so don't know. Greetings for Ooh. it is I am I sell crystals from ah, 
Beware the pestilence. All right. Let's see. It's weird because I don't know why he even gave me the option to skip the tutorial because um, I didn't even finish it on the first playthrough. Like I said, I only touched the crystal and that was it. So many new faces. Welcome, Sam. Heard you. Can't say. Th you mean the one they hauled into the center of town there? That thing hadn't been active for over a decade. I could be anywhere. Well, I hope you don't give up on him. Ford now. <laughs> I suspect he'll come back when he's good and ready. But folks are worried about Clementine. Ooh, getting right to business. You might find. Keep your right. wits about you. He's got the good stuff. I see those steroids. And then I get my... Basically, he's the one that gives me the class. Let me double check though. Hold on, how do I? Okay. Traveler. I know you'd say that. Oh, so you craft too. Relic charge, orbs of undoing, reset all spent trade points, and need scraps and then three of eliminate, whatever they're called. Eliminate crystals, scrap, okay. Until next time. Alright, brother. All right, now I just gotta figure out what to do. Is there like a questing? Hold on. Weapon mod, I get that. Traits, I have one. Power level one. Oh, okay, so I'm just level one. So, <clears throat> primary objectives, where the hell would that be at? There's nothing that says that here. World stone, world shard, main path. Unexplored, explored, non hostile. Okay. Oh, let me touch the crystal then. I have no idea. What to do. destination yes sir you don't know where they found these bandages but they look like they've been through hell and back but hey beggars can't be choosers or the beggars can't be choosers I don't know what that means. all right Clementine Ford where are you guys? This is all insane. Both the Crystal and Ford. God, I better get moving if I'm gonna find Clementine.
Alright, got some iron. for long and long. The pestilence takes me. Or is it now simply part of what I am? It has been so long. The difference hardly matters. But the Paxel attack. How comes it here, to Yesha? The right crystal. I have seen them in my restless slumber. The pestilence think of them often, especially the stones of the Paxotex Earth. I am Bidel of the Vaunt. When this world was young, the pan did service to the green and growing things. Now, the pan betrays the world. And the world, the wolf, betrays the pan. I'm looking for somebody. You mentioned a wolf. Are the real thing or just a metaphor? Those of its kind rarely walk this land. Paxotak, it would seem, come only at times of great change. First, the Krell. Then the one called Ford. Even our god, the one of many, not stand against the backs of deck. Wait, why did he? No, that was not the fort. The backs of deck that killed our god became known as the destroyer. The backs of deck fort became known as the Empress's Bane. Okay. So have you seen Ford? Did he come through? The game? Empress's Bane has not been to Yesha in a generation. Not since another yet in the same generation. I have... <laughs> Who can say what has transpired in the... Alas, I know it was. The Ravager. Plague of the Pan and Defiler of the Doe. The Wolf hunt once part of... And the Red if it seeks to save its own life and world. The puzzle tech must hunt the Ravager and end it. The beast is not alone. One servant of the beware, Puzzle Tech. I can assure the puzzle. May the red door. That is disgusting, man. Look at him. Oh my god. They, they messed him up. Whatever they did, or whoever did that. Or maybe he chose that. Let's see. Make sure to check everything, man. One of those types that likes to look everywhere to loot stuff. that noise. Oh, I won't do that again. Can I go through here? I guess not. All right.
Ah, damn, bro. Oh, damn. Bro, too early. Yeah, this is gonna get some time to get used to. Oh no, there's gotta be a faster reload than that. Here they come. Press L1 and R1 to use your primary scale, okay. Thing didn't even stand a chance. See what's up here real quick. That dude is crazy, bro. I need help. This feels weird to dodge, man. I think it's on fat rolling or something. This. Oh my god, bro, I already died. That's hilarious. Alright, try this again. I don't give you that much ammo, do they? Can't get used to the controllers, that's all, man. No, not the controller, the, the controls of this game. I thought they resetted all the enemies.
think that's it. It's just poison. Be some ammo. Yeah, they don't even give you that much ammo. What do you got? Damn. I wonder if there's like crates or something. Yeah, big boy. Take that. All right. No, I don't even know where he came from, bro. Cause he was he didn't pop up the first time. Don't want to waste all my main ammo. 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 But there's two of them. Where the other one? Let's see if my buddy wants to run this together. He played it when it first came out. So. He would have to make a new character, obviously. I wouldn't want him to rock his maxed out character in my playthrough. Alright. Dude, that dodge roll, bro. So slow. Cherry blossoms? That's pretty cool. Resting. Resting at checkpoints, replenishes ammo and relics at the cost of respawning all basic enemies in the world. Oh, okay, so elite enemies are not respawning. Multiplayer. Resting also respawns any fallen allies. All players must be using a checkpoint in order to rest. Alright. Go back real quick though. 
Cause it says there's a non-hostile around here. Where is that? What summons me from my ethereal wanderings? New Zar. What kind of beast is this? Tech. I can share my wanderings with you, but first, I seek the knowing, the truth of nature held within your ark. You want to answer? So I will ask. Answer these questions true, sweet beast, so that your ark may be known and your eye may open. And do choose wisely. Answer from your heart. Okay. Your vessel sinks at sea, and there is only one skiff. It cannot hold every soul aboard, and now sits dangerously low in the water. The sea becomes rough, and the skiff begins to fill. If nothing is done, it will sink before rescue arrives, and everyone on board will drown. Okay. There are a few injured souls who may not survive until rescue reaches you anyway. If you let them drown, the rest of you will likely survive. Do you throw the injured souls overboard or risk letting the skiff sink? Oh, that's a tough one. That is a tough one. Ah, <sighs> me personally, I would be throw them overboard. Because if we all go down, you know, well, we all die. Oh, this, oh, I wish it was more specific on the scenario, man. Because if we're like, if the adults had to jump, like go overboard to save the young people, then that would be the likely best scenario, but. has been killed the murderer is arrested and after many years they are sentenced to death before the sentence is carried out they come to you and explain that they are truly sorry and they ask for your forgiveness nothing you say will change their sentence nor bring your daughter back do you forgive them yes you forgive them you forgive them but you don't forget it's it's sad, but at the end of the day, you gotta let go of all regret, all regret, all anger, all whatever you have. Because at the end of the day, that they're gonna get what they deserve, which is their own death coming to them. So, yes, I forget. I see. Two clans have warred for generations. Your matriarch calls for a battle of champions to bring a final end to the bloodshed, and you are chosen to fight. Your opponent is the eldest but weakest son of your enemy. He offers you no threat, and you best him easily. But you must slay him to end the war. Do you spare the scion of your family foe, or kill him and end the war? Is it going to end the war? I don't think it is. Ha! Oh dear. <clears throat> no bother, it's nothing. Moving on. Consider that it is you who discovers the thing. The tree that offers immortality to all who eat its fruit. Okay. You could share this gift with all, but doing so may lead to war and embitterment. To the immortality of those who do not deserve it and will only abuse eternal life. Or you could limit immortality to the deserving and thus, through the deserving, bring a better life for all. Do you give immortality to all? 
or only a chosen few? Oh, what fun this is! <laughs> you are part of a group of druids who have been taken hostage by a warlord. One of the warlord soldiers succumbs to your charms and says he will help you escape. However, the others must be left behind to die, though all have done nothing. Do you abandon your fellow hostages, or do you face death together? I'm sorry, if there's random strangers... I would have to say... I'd rather save myself. I guess it depends on the scenario, man, because... Because let, let's be frank. What is it? How is all of us dying together? A better option, you know? Fascinating. You have chosen your path, sweet beast. Your will is strong. The fire of the Ravager's eye glows within you. Bloodstream. <coughs> Not your average trait, huh? Okay, let's so tell me In about the this. In the arc of every being, there are two eyes. We may see out of either, but most favor one over the other. The Ravager's eye is dynamic, driven, and endlessly hungry. Yet for all its power, its vision is clouded. The eye of the Ravager rarely sees beyond its own satiation. Like an animal chasing its tail, it knows no rest. The Doe's eye sees only what is before it. The gift of the Doe is subtle, easily missed. It is a most mysterious presence inside oneself, conferring power without force. Just as the doe itself cannot be sought, nor tracked, nor hunted. By answering true, sweet beast, you give me a wink. And now, the gifts of your dominant eye will be open to you. Hmm. Okay. Would you care to hear a tale? It is about those who see as you do. Huh, yeah. I'm actually, this character is actually pretty interesting. I will tell you the tale of Belgoth, who also saw with the Ravager's eye. Belgoth lived in the era before the Root first bedeviled the pan and nipped at their hairy hooves. Belgoth was Drinkmaster of Flint, a village beyond the hill. One day, when Belgov was traveling far afield, Flint was raided by bandits. They laid waste to every soul, old and young. Belgov returned to find everyone he cared for watering the soil with their blood. Well, Belgov tapped his store of spirit, filling Growler and Jeroboam by the gaggle, and he hoofed himself to my grove. Where lies the bandit's lair? He demanded. His eye was open, and I had no reason to deceive him. At my direction, Belgov tintinabulated to their den. There, he smashed a jug on his horns and struck flint with steel, and Belgov was reborn as a flaming figure of vengeance. He charged into the bandit's lair, Hoof over hand, and in his enemy's bosom, the remaining stock of spirit took spark with explosive result. Some consider this a waste of life. Or could not Belgoth have traveled elsewhere and rebuilt what he had lost? But I'll tell you this. Flynn's sister village stood free from bandit attacks for many years after that day. Belgoth's blaze of glory saved it. He died with the Ravager's eye open, and no mercy in his heart. Terrible waste to drink, though. Is there <laughs> anything else? 
gotten knowledge of me? Of our wonderful world? Yeah, who are you? You stand before Meadra, spirit of the natural world, daughter of stem and stream. My sisters and I are the glorious weavers of all wild beauty. When mountain, oh, okay. spring, and sturdy tree trunk take your breath, sweet beast, that is us, an immeasurable number. Mother stem and mother stream rely on us to sprawl and grow. Though we don't often commune with beasties such as you. Not in this age. Especially not since what happened to Kaula. A tragedy, beast. Tragedy most cruel. Kaula was fascinated by mortals, by your lives and stories. Unlike most of us, she made herself no secret. And you worshipped her with your short lives. Even built her a house. Huh. A temple, you called it. The root found her there. We godlings are not easily unwoven, however. And it slew her not. But perhaps That's it would be better if it had. For what remains is no longer the sister I knew. But we hold happy thoughts. Regret only wastes one life with another. Is there something else we can talk about? <laughs> by day, okay. a dappled glade of em by night. By night, sweet beast. The trees or so it was before farewell, uh, sweet beast. I actually enjoyed talking to that one. That was pretty pretty good. I love the scenarios. To be fair, that scenario with the that story that she just told. It makes sense that he would do that. People who kill the young and the elderly deserve harsh punishments. Let's be honest, that's how our justice system is. Uh, well, in North America at least, that's how our justice system is. If you, if you do harm to a young or a like the elderly who are considered like uh, vulnerable, coming? individuals you get a harsher sentence so it makes sense that you would want to take revenge with that See what's over here real quick. And go to ammo. Great. We're bad news. You should have been dead. Scraps. Hopefully, I find her her sisters. It'll be interesting to talk to them as well. I wonder if her mother and father is that what I understood? Are still alive as well? Talk to them. Be interesting. Oh, 
What was that noise, man? I pay attention to my surroundings more often. That was ridiculous. All right, let's go back over there. No, there's another one here. Where is that? Good. Where is that guy with the bow? <laughs> looks good, man. Bro, is it? That's how, how disgusting these fucking creatures are. Hold on, I gotta back up. Lucky he makes noise, man, while he teleports. What the hell, bro? Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> 
Alright. Handgun ammo. Let's go and game playing like on gun handgun ammo. Alright. How do I get rid of this rot, man? I think I need to dodge all his shots, man. Nothing but handgun ammo, that's crazy. <coughs> I know I have another gun. There we go. Alright. <coughs> Dude, this coughing is annoying. Oh, I was here before, okay. I just went around in a circle. So far I'm actually liking this game, it's not too bad. <coughs> I haven't fought a boss yet, but we'll see how that goes. <coughs> well, this doesn't look <coughs> good. I can't believe there's non like threatening animals like that. save the first clip of this. <coughs> I got five minutes, so I'll save it. Startled me, bro. All right, let me save it now. It sucks because the PlayStation can only save our clips. 